Like my mama has been, uh, she got arrested in 2011. When it first happened, I was like, because me being the youngest child, like my, my father was never around. So then my mom, only like support system, it kind of, I mean, I was making straight A's and I just, last year I just started back bringing that up. When it first happened, I want to say the first two weeks after it happened, like my grades, first they dropped. Like they started, they started to go from A's and B's to like, C's. I think I had a D in a class and the teacher started to notice it. So she pulled me aside and said, Leandra, what's wrong? You know, just because you, you have some adversity when you're younger doesn't mean that you can't be a success. So he is definitely a success story uh, for Gulfport High School and it's all because of him. He has obviously no special relationship with his band director and they've, you know, gone above and beyond what's expected of anybody as an educator, taking him on college visits, making sure that he's going to have sheets on his bed at college, making sure he's going to have towels, making sure that the stuff that parents usually take care of, it's taken care of for him. Like, they've been nothing but good people to us. Like, they always helped us out whenever we need anything or if we just wanted to go in there, they treated us like nothing other than a family, you know, like we were welcome. And like every time I think of it, I'm like, man, what I need to do is stay focused in school, do what I have to do in school so I can still, you know, be somebody and be successful. Well, Leandre's not the first Leandre to come through here. Um, there's a Leandre every year a kid with that kind of story. I mean, he actually is super impressive and has pushed himself maybe a little bit harder than most. He's probably pushed himself harder than a kid who had three meals a day, a new car when they got their license and every, you know, everything was easy for that kid. He's, he's pushed beyond um, probably what most thought he could even do. Sometimes when students come from homes where they're that, the education may not be as important, you know, obviously it's our job to, to make sure that they know the importance, but, um, you know, students have to know that it's relevant. You know, kids need to know that where, what they're doing is relevant. Um, and, I, and then from that, I think, comes the effort um, and the success. Like, our mom, when she was raising us, she kept telling us that no matter what, you know, keep our head focused, and, um, like, keep our faith. So I was always telling her, Mom, when I get older, everything's gonna be okay. I'm gonna take care of everything. Cause I was like, I'm gonna keep making good grades in school. If no one else does, I'm gonna keep that focus. And when I do, I'm gonna go to college, start my own business, and this family gonna be right.